This is exactly how you can get more clients without having to cold call. Nice. When I first started as a personal trainer, I walked into a gym and they handed me a lead list and said, here, call them. Hello? And that's how you're going to get clients. And I was like, huh, okay. So I rang 10 people, three of which told me to off five of them said they had no time to talk to me and then two of them didn't answer so i thought to myself five people who said they don't have time okay great so what we're going to do instead is get them to call us now how do we do that you say well we're going to be using voicemails oh we're going to send people voicemails with the intention of them calling us back we're going to use automation to do it there are two pieces of software that you need for this go high level and something to record your voice now i'm using audacity because it's free and it's easy so what we're going to do, once you've got your high level account, we're going to go on the left hand side and go into automation. We're going to click create new workflow. We're going to click start from scratch. I'm going to give it a name, just calling it voicemail drops. And we're going to start with a workflow trigger. We need something to start this automation. When we add in contacts, we're going to tag them with something specific. I'm going to use the tag anti cold call. So whenever someone is tagged with anti cold call, they'll get added into this sequence. And they'll get sent the voicemail. So clicking on add workflow trigger. And then on the right hand side, I'm going to search for tag. <laughs> tag contact then we're going to add a filter and tag added anti cold call and then we press save trigger for our first action i'm actually going to add in a five minute delay when you add bulk tags to people sometimes there can be mistakes that are made you don't want things to start automating and outreaching instantly in case you've tagged the wrong people or you haven't just done something right so I add a delay in there just in case anything goes wrong, you can go in and stop it if need be. So I'm searching for the wait function. I'm gonna click that and I'm just gonna add a five minute delay. And then we press save action. After that, we're gonna press plus and then we are going to search for voicemail. It is asking us for a voicemail file. So we need to record that and then upload it. So we've got Audacity open. Now I'm going to show you how I'm gonna record this voicemail and it's with the idea to get people calling us back. So we're gonna use a little trick. I'm going to use my old gym as an example. Hey, it's Matt calling from Good Life. If you could, that's it, right? That's all we need to say. But the intention of this is to get them to be intrigued enough to want to call us back. So if we then take that clip and then we export it as MP3 and we're just gonna call it voicemail and we're gonna minimize out of Audacity and we're back in Go High Level. We're gonna click on Upload File and we are going to find our voicemail map open and we're going to save the action now we have our automation this will run whenever you add the tag in in order for this to work you're going to need a lead list that is digital this is an example of what i've just quickly set up here of the format that it needs to be name email phone number and when you have the list ready to go you're just going to export it to a csv so we're going to we're going to click file and then download as a csv and once we have that We've saved our voicemail drops automation. We're going to go back into Go High Level and we're going to import the contacts. We're in our contacts page and we just need to press the import button, which is import contacts. And we can just drag this file in here. Next, it's going to ask us to map the fields. So you need to tell Go High Level which field is equal to which value. So it's already done it for us because it's pretty smart. Sometimes you may just need to change that and may come up as a different value. Import name. We're just going to call this voicemail test and under advanced, we're going to add in a tag. Now I said we are doing anti cold call. So you just select anti cold call here and then you press submit. Now I'm not going to do that because I put in a random phone number and a random person is going to get my voicemail. Who the hell is this bitch? Now one of my clients who did this with 20 contacts got 10 callbacks within the first hour. So I would recommend only doing 20 or so at a time to make sure that you can keep up with the demand of calls because people are going to be curious and they're going to be calling back. Now you're still going to need to pitch them your offer. You're still going to need to get them in for a session or get them in for a consult. That part's up to you, but this does take away the I don't have time objection.